Second one is up. Off the rim. Three times it in. Three-point lead for High Point. 5.3 to go. Candace Brown at midcourt with two seconds. Has to force up a shot at the buzzer. No good. High Point's to the final. A tremendous comeback from the Panthers. They had four free throws in the final minute and beat Gardner-Webb 56-53. That's how it ended here at the HTC Center on Saturday night as the High Point University women's basketball team will play for the Big South Championship, knocking off Gardner-Webb 56-53. Hi everybody, Kevin Burke with you. Thanks for tuning in to highpointpanthers.com. The Panthers were down by as many as eight in the second half, but tremendous resiliency from this team. So many defensive stops down the stretch. In fact, High Point forced Gardner-Webb to miss 19 of their final 21 shots in the contest as High Point rallied for the three-point victory. Panthers were down by two with 30 seconds to go. The Kayla Keys forced a turnover, was fouled, ended up making two free throws. On the ensuing possession, Stacia Robertson swatted away Candace Brown's shot off of Candace Brown. The Panthers got two more free throws from Lindsey Puckett. And you just saw how it ended. Robertson led the way for High Point Player of the Year numbers again. 24 points, eight rebounds, three blocks for Stacia. Kayla Keys had 10 points for the Panthers. They're off to the final against Liberty tomorrow. Here's what Deanna Hendricks had to say. What a game, huh? <laughs> uh, God, no, I give all credit to them. You know, they played extremely hard, uh, extremely well. Um, just really, really proud of our kids' resiliency. Um, I have a senior group that does not want to go home anytime soon, and so I thought that really showed the second half. Most of the attention is on Stacia, well-deserved. <laughs> I mean, look at her. But um, that kind of just opened it up for me. Um, when I came off ball screens, especially if uh, Stacia was setting it, uh, they didn't really rotate off of me. They stayed on her, and that just kind of opened up the lane for me to make those layups. We're excited. I don't think it really matters. Tomorrow's a championship game, so we got Liberty, so we're really excited for it. So for the second straight year, High Point will play on Championship Sunday, and it'll be at 5 o'clock against the number one seed, Liberty Flames. We knocked off High Point in both games in the regular season. Hope to see you here in Conway. If not, check it out on ESPN3. They got you covered on highpointpanthers.com. Thanks for clicking. I'm Kevin Burke.